Let's talk a little bit about why we're changing these things. And primarily, it comes down to that we've been listening to you. Beginning with control licenses, because this is probably the most exciting one. And as has already been spoiled a couple times uh, by some folks before me, um, control becomes intrinsic in QSYS 10.0. That means that any core running 10.0 or newer does not need a UCI deployment license to deploy UCI's user control interfaces to a touchscreen and does not need a scripting engine license to use the Lua scripting capabilities of the core. So why are we making this change now? Well, it used to make a lot more sense uh, to have control as a licensable feature. You know, early on in the, in the life of that feature, not everyone was ready to use QSYS control, and it made sense that you can pay for it when you use it and not pay for it when you don't use it. Today, we've noticed that somewhere around 80% of the cores we sell have scripting and UCI licenses attached to them. So we talked about it, we made the decision, it no longer makes sense for us to burden our customers with the additional steps of purchasing and installing these licenses, and we're just going to include it in every core going forward. Um, in order to make this change, we also need to build the cost of that functionality into the base cost of the core, and that is something we're gonna be doing. Um, but I wanna be clear, the cost that we're going to be building into the cores is actually less than today's cost of a scripting and UCI license. So for the 80% of you that use scripting and UCI with every project that you do, this is actually gonna be a price decrease. Um, for the 20% of you that are not using scripting and UCI all the time, um, this is probably a great opportunity to reevaluate whether there's some value in QSYS control that you can take advantage of. And so the big announcement today is we are not going to be offering scaling licenses for any of the new cores that we've announced. So Core 24F, Server Core X10, Server Core X20R will always ship fully capable out of the box with no license required. And to further simplify our licensing portfolio here, we're going to actually combine those two scaling licenses together into just a single scaling license for Core Nano and Core 8 Flex. Uh, and that single license will have the same capabilities as both of the previous licenses combined.